So we're really excited to share with you today something new that we've been uh, working on over the last few months. Um, so this is a design tool to help end users, people who want to build their own house, um, come up with um, initial designs. Um, it's not meant to replace working with an architect. The idea is that an end user can use this to map out the first stage of their project and get a kind of feel for what the design might be like. Um, so we have a kind of an area here where we have a model of a house. So here we have a model with the roof, a ground floor and a first floor. Um, on the shelf behind us here, we've got a whole load of other components that we can use. Um, and I'll show you placing here in a minute. And then in front we have a ground floor plan and then a first floor plan above um, that emerge as we start to build the model. Um, also, we've got data here that live updates um, as we're um, as we're building. Um, so the idea it updates the floor area, the cost, the number of uh, slices of the house here, um, number of sheets of ply used to build it and hours of labour. So this is built using a WikiHouse uh, system, uh, which is an open source construction technique. Um, at the moment, these costs um, aren't accurate and all just kind of indicative for the moment. Uh, we'll need to update those to make them more realistic over time. But let's show you how this works. So if I get pick up one of these sections, I can pick this one up here um, that's uh, got a staircase um, as part of it. And I place it here. And as I place it next to this, it snaps into place there. I'm just going to move myself slightly over there, that's better. Um, and so if we pick up another one, so we can just start to build um, the house uh, like this, picking up the sections that we need. And if we look here, so as I place this into the work area, all that data live updates. Um, which hopefully is providing really good feedback to the end user um, in terms of thinking about where their budget goes um, and how much they want to spend on the house. Um, so I'm now going to pick up a dividing wall, uh, one, one for the first floor, um, put that in there and then I can start to pick up the furniture. So first of all, I'll pick up a um, sofa there and place that downstairs and pick up another one here place that place that next to it somewhere around there there we go um, so arrange that Ooh, <laughs> it's bouncing around in there um, and you can see as I'm placing those um, this one as I'm placing those they're ar arranging down um, on the first one I'm going to take that one out in the middle actually just rearrange that a bit more. There we go, it's a bit neater. Um, so you can see that the, the furniture live updating um, on the plan over here as well. So now I'll get a bed and place that up on the first floor. Um, and also a set of shelves, which we'll just put over here. And then some lights, um, which I'll just place above the bed and maybe uh, pick up a chair as well. we'll put in that bedroom. Um, so as you can see, as we've been adding all of these elements, the costs here and the area has been increasing. Um, for things like, say, an electric car charging point, um, these are cards that as you place here onto the um, onto the surface, um, live update these costs as well. So this allows us to just add simple things like a kind of hardwood floor, uh, underfloor heating system, um, an ensuite bathroom. So that's a way of quickly kind of without having to build all of it in this model, um, live update those costs. And again, you can see the plans that are being created for us in front here. So once there's a design that you kind of like, you um, press a button here. And so now suddenly we've gone to full scale. So from this being like a doll's house model, now it feels like it's a full scale house that we're walking around. Um, so I can go and sit here um, in between uh, in between the sofas um, and could sort of sit down on that, see how that feels. Um, and then if I go upstairs, there's that bookshelf that we placed and looking out there, looking out at the view. Um, and then behind us is the bed um, and the chair. Um, we should be able to say this bed isn't quite up against that wall. I should be able to pick that up um, and put that 
into place in a more suitable um, area. There we go, so it's a little bit more aligned with the wall there. Um, and then go to the door here, look down the stairs and see what the hallway feels like. Um, so yeah, it's really great um, being able to kind of design something basically as a model and then actually be able to go and um, walk around that. Um, so this, that with the combined with getting this live updates on the costs, we think is a really exciting um, potential for engaging end users and people who want to build their own house to basically be able to play around themselves um, in their own time, to be able to think about designs, think about costs, and then be able to come to an architect uh, to work in more detail, to work to work out the kind of some of the more uh, complex elements of that build. Um, yeah, so we're really excited about this. We'd really love to hear what other people uh, think of it. And um, if anyone wants to get in touch to talk about this further, um, we're really up for kind of discussing it in more detail. Um, yeah, thanks. Thanks for watching.